Leith Links, a large public park situated north of Edinburgh's city centre. Historically, it comprised of grassy hillocks and sand dunes. Today, it's mostly flat, grassy parkland and home to a children's play area, tennis courts and a bowling green. Two large grassy hillocks named as Giant's Bray and Lady Fife's Bray are listed as monuments of national importance by Historic Environment Scotland. They are thought to date back to 1560 to the so-called Siege of Leith. However, their true origin remains a mystery. Today, Leith Lynx is used solely for recreation. It can host large festival events, such as concerts and fairground attractions. The Hickory Open is held here each year. Teams compete for the championship using ancient Hickory clubs. There is one surprising bit of history which was instrumental in the naming of the park Leith Lynx. It was one of Scotland's earliest golf courses. A bronze statue and three informative plaques now sit within a specially landscaped miniature golf course commemorating John Ratchery's signing of the very first set of golf rules back in 1744. John Ratchery. What's your name? My name is Rattray. John Rattray. How old are you? Oh, let me think. What year is it now? It's 2022. I see. Well, I was born in 1707, so I'm over 300 years old. That's old. 308, I think. Well, you're a good golfer. Yes, I was. Winner of the Silver Club here on Leith Links. On two occasions. Well, I'd better get back to my family. It was nice talking to you. Remember to tell your friends about this golfing history and how the very first rules of golf were written here on Leith Links. I will. Goodbye. Bye.
You can visit the John Rattree statue and learn about his story here within the specially landscaped area on the north side of Leith Links. A visit here during a stay in Edinburgh will provide an insight into this remarkable golfing history at Leith Links. <laughs>